My name is Amy. I am a 19-year-old revert, previously Christian, and am from the UK. Thank you for Muslim Convert Stories for allowing me to share my story with you. I have always been exposed to Islam growing up, as my city is very diverse. This then led me to already have a standard amount of knowledge when it came to Islam, and I often would spend time with other Muslims. Around summer 2019, I was on a downward spiral, being involved in situations and living a lifestyle that were going to take me on a path straight to the hellfire, astafrullah. I was always trying to find happiness in temporary things or seek validation in harmful ways. Skipping forward a few months, I then got to April 2020, specifically during the start of Ramadan, and had this yearn to teach myself more about Islam than I already knew and really understand the religion. This was also motivated by someone close to me fasting during Ramadan and informing me of their experiences every year as a born Muslim. I then started my journey step by step, month by month. I started off with telling nobody for a while, even though I knew a lot of born Muslims. I was too nervous to open up that I was being pulled away from Christianity and towards Islam instead. Alhamdulillah. I bought five books, including the Quran, at the start and began reading them every evening in secret, listening to Islamic songs or recitations and watching lectures. As my knowledge and understanding for Islam grew, my need to know more and do more also grew fast. I felt as though I had this light bulb moment where everything made sense to me. My purpose of life, this dunya, the afterlife, etc. It was like no other experience I had before. Even thinking about it brought tears because it was the validation and peace I had been seeking for my whole teenage life. As every month went on, I started to integrate Islam into my life more. For example, I gave up my previous bad habits that were haram in July 2020 completely, recycled my old non-modest clothing to charities, changed my social media to be more modest, started learning how to pray and wearing hijab, and start listening to Quran, or read every chance I get. July 2020 came around, especially Eid il Adha, and I finally decided to open up to another Muslim about my journey. She was so welcoming and supportive, I couldn't have asked for a better reaction. A few months down the line, she is still the person I'm most closest to and helps me with Islam. Around this time, I was starting to put more hints out there on my social media or make slight hints to the people around me so that when I eventually open up to them, it wouldn't be as much of a shock. Some people also would message me asking, Are you Muslim now? Or, Are you a revert? From the help of my new sister, I started to become more confident and content with wearing hijab, posting Islamic-related content, opening up to my non-Muslim friends, etc. I took a trip to London with her and decided to wear hijab the whole duration of the trip as it was out of my city. This was the best decision I could have made as I now wear it as much as I possibly can around most people and have deleted my pictures showing my hair. I have become so happy while I wear hijab as I feel closer to Allah and can be identified for who I truly am, a Muslim. It had been just under a week since I took my shahada. I feel blessed beyond words to have been guided down this path in general, but even more so at a young age, so I can live the rest of my life living and knowing the truth. It was a Friday evening I was with my closest friend, who has been helping me with Islam for some time. We met up with a few other girls who have been welcoming to Islam along with her parents. I also had the opportunity to meet another revert with his wife and daughter, who kindly spent his evening to talk to me about his experience. We spent the evening in conversation, 
having Syrian food, and then actually taking my shahada. Once I had taken my shahada, I started crying and was so emotional. It was a feeling that I had never experienced, the feeling of content and peace more than I have ever felt before. I was so overwhelmed with happiness and still am. Finding Islam is the best thing that has ever happened to me, and I couldn't be more thankful.